After hours of searching, with more than 100 law enforcement officers on the ground, police have apprehended suspected Central Michigan University shooter James Eric Davis Jr. The danger in, in, that our community has experienced over the last 24 hours or so has been, uh, has been, uh, is now over. At around midnight Saturday, police got a tip from a person on a train saying they had seen Davis on the north end of CMU's campus. Police responded and took Davis into custody without incident. Uh, within two minutes, CMU police officers were on scene and within a minute after that had uh, the suspect in custody, um, which put an end to the threat of violence to our community. So we're very, very pleased that, uh, again, someone in our uh, community got involved, made the phone call, they saw something, they said something, and we were able to respond. Investigators say Davis killed his parents, James Eric Davis Sr. and Diva Janine Davis. Davis Sr. was a longtime police officer for the Illinois town of Bellwood. The town's mayor spoke on why Davis's parents went to CMU Friday. I think that James had mentioned to some people that he was going up there possibly to pick up his son. We know he's going to take a visit to his son at Central Michigan University. Now, as the manhunt ends, the students of Central Michigan University must recover from the shooting and double murder that rocked their campus. The hurting will go on for a while. And we'll do whatever is necessary. When today is gone and the cameras aren't here anymore, there'll be students on our campus and faculty and staff members uh, suffering from the incident that happened today. And the care for those individuals will continue as we move forward. For My News 26, I'm Remington Hernandez.